<laughs> Welcome back to Cardinal Sins. Where, uh, hey, we got seen <laughs> the moment I uh, jumped back into the game. Because, uh, unfortunately, that guy took a, decided to wait until I was just hitting escape to do the hard save between sessions to start walking through the door. And uh, my quick save was a moment before, so I could have scummed my way out of that, I suppose. But uh, I chose not to. Besides, any of you who did see the guy come through right at the end of the last episode, just, you know, just as it stopped, would be obviously waiting for the payoff. And there's the payoff for you. I've been seen, he's run off to get help. I don't know when he's going to be coming back. I don't know how much... Whether I'm at all safe. Doing anything here. Alright, that's better. I don't think that's the fellow who saw us. He seems entirely unurgent. Oh, it's brightly lit inside here as well. Okay, I... Right. That's the reliquary, right? Mm, was that the small chapel? That looks like the small chapel. I've not been in, so this is the way in. This is the way I came in. Um, I think the door there. And then, then we can hide up in this corner. Yeah, that's, that's the best. Oh, that's a lamp, but looking up, I was wondering what I was seeing. So the eternal flame is just around the corner here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he was the guy going. He was the guy who saw us, maybe. Going into the small chapel there, having calmed down. I don't know where the guy walking down the passage there is. Not coming this way, apparently. Okay, this shadow is dark enough to hide in, someone's just coming through the doors there. Let's wait for them. Alright, so we have we have some idea where we are. We want to get to the library and the baths at least. I don't know what we need their key for, to be quite honest, but um, at least that's a that's a destination. I mean we're trying to find Oh steal the weeping widow statue from the pub. Where the fuck is the pub? How did this objective... Oh, that was one of the extra objectives for Expert. Right, yeah, 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 yeah. Where the fuck is the pub? Not where the drunk guy was. That wasn't the building you could enter. Alright. Cathedral's main altar. At least we know where to go for that. We don't know where the crown is kept, but I guess we'll find out. Doesn't... Reliquary, probably. Um, and the information Proyas is using. Well, I have no idea who Proyas... Where Proyas... But you guess he'll have an office somewhere, right? Is it marked? High priest's office. Is he the high priest? He might be occupying the high priest's office at any rate. be an obvious place to start looking. You look upon the eternal flame of the Builder's Forge. As long as the flame still burns, we know the Builder still stands against the darkness and watches over our world. Well, and we cannot get in. This door does not open, but... Oh, there's rings on that. They look like they might be valuable. Oh, 
that was lucky timing. Who are you? Okay, this guy wandering this way, I think, is the guy I saw. No, oh, the other guy I saw was on this side of the hotel. Oh, oh, careful, then. Doesn't seem to be any loot up there on that ledge, but, uh... So, I don't know, is that wood? It looks like it might be wood. Uh, we do need to get to the main altar, though, right? But let us do the experiment. Did I just miss? I did just miss. Slightly too high. It is wood. Okay. Good news is it is wood. We have an we have a route up. We have an escape route. Those are both useful things. Now one of these guys comes around here and goes in these doors. So I can't really go in there just yet, right? These are very fancy pillars. Those are cool too. That's a good. Uh, that's a really good use of objects. I mean, these objects are way more detailed than I like. Cause it's kind of like if you're gonna use high detailed objects, it really looks. Well, no, they can't squeeze through there though. It looks super weird when you've got all these really low detail character models. I'm gonna leave those doors open because that's my escape route. I can't squeeze through there either. These narrow gaps that are just not... Everything's everything's all just... Squashed. Fucking hell! He's stuck on these objects. I hear thee there. <laughs> Any better, or is it also now it's also impossible to squeeze around there? Uh, and I won't be able to jump through there either. Just... This doesn't feel like a level made to be moved through. It's so annoying. I mean, I'm gonna have to walk along this silly, noisy, dang center thing while people are going back and forth. And wow, there's someone standing up by the altar just watching everything. Everybody's coming and going through here. This is not the way to approach the altar anyway. I was just asking for trouble. There's nowhere to hide up there. I don't know what the, what the way to approach the altar is, but that isn't it. That's just... That's just asking for trouble. And if we start above, we'll have a better view of things, at least, but... Safe to say, I'm not really having too much fun with this mission. It's just... <clears throat> hey, if I knocked everybody out, it'd be super fucking easy. That doesn't mean I want it super fucking hard, because I'm choosing not to knock anybody out. coming up here as well, right? <laughs> well, there was somebody there. I'm going to leave that rope. I've got, got quite a lot of them. Not 
Not even dark here. Doesn't help much. I guess it does in this corner. Who was that guy who said he thought he spied something anyway? Let me turn the lights off completely in this room. Wow. Still light coming in from outdoors, but from the windows. Um. I think I've done a good job with the of with placing the lighting so it appears to be coming from the windows, considering this doesn't do area lights. Um, it's annoying that you've got to jump even to get into the shadows. That's just like, yeah. should I stop complaining about the ways that this level annoys me? Where would the fun be then? I hope this guy doesn't come close enough to bump into me. That would be extra fun. We'll wait and see. Wait and see. Very fancy table and chairs. Meeting notes, 12th of Sun, Feb, 218, Alliance Calendar. Item 1. The crown to be placed in St. Alexius' tomb for safekeeping. Cardinal Tyburn questioned why it should not be placed in the reliquary. Cardinal Ulrich responded that the traps in the reliquary are not guaranteed fatal, but the poison gas traps in the tomb of St. Alexius are. Item 2. Our distinguished visitor, Cardinal Press, will have his temporary quarters in the Rutherford Square apartments just outside the cathedral's western entrance. Since there is no more room in the rectory. You're fucking kidding me. Item 3. Vote for new hierarch was held. Cardinal Spreus and Gallian voted to name Cardinal Spreus. Cardinals Wolfstrand, Dalmont and Martinian voted to name Cardinal Wolfstrand. Cardinals Ulrich and Tyburn voted present. Meeting notes. 15th of Sunzeb, 218 Alliance Calendar. Item 1. As the deliberations of this council have grown more turbulent, in an effort to foster trust, it has been decided that the Loyalist faction and the Restoration faction shall each have possession of one of the Crypt Keys. Cardinal Wallstrand and Cardinal Proyas received the keys today. Cardinal Ulrich mentioned he was considering additional precautions to ward the Crypt against intrusion, but did not elaborate when questioned. Item 2. Vote for new hierarch was held. Cardinals Proyas, Gallian and Tyburn voted to name Cardinal Proyas. Cardinals Wallstrand, Dalmont and Martinian voted to name Cardinal Wallstrand. Cardinal Ulrich voted present. Okay, so Tyburn, they got over to their side, but now it's neck and neck. Three, three for three. Here it was two to three. Is that not enough of a majority? I guess they need a uh, plurality. At least. Well, sorry, that's a plurality. They need a majority, because we're not at least four if they're eight. Or whatever. I don't know. I can't do maths. What's the important here? Uh, Wallstrand probably has the key. Proyas will have one key. Additional precautions toward the crypt. So the crypt already had... The Tomb of St. Alexius has poison gas. The crypt has got extra traps. The reliquary has traps that are not necessarily fatal. Uh, this is the one that pisses me off. The place we were in before, Cardinal Proyas' rooms. Uh, which is probably where we need to find the blackmail info, so we probably need to go back there and search that bedroom faster, which means you're going to have to go uh, do all the fucking work to get back in there again. Get back out of here and back in there. And I am so pissed off by that. Alright, uh, Matt, what are we doing? Wallstrand. Uh, Wallstrand's P? Question mark? What else? Uh, Crypt. Crypt. Traps? Question mark? Well. I'm going to say got it. Defended somehow. We don't know how. Uh, tomb of Alexius. Crown. Poison gas traps. Reliquary. 
perhaps non-fatal, at least not guaranteed fatal. And out here, not where he is. So black blackmail info. No, let's let's write that up here. Probably. There's now an objective of ours, so hearing extra footsteps, I don't know if we're gonna get seen. Was there anything more in that? There was there was something else I vaguely remember wanting to note. I mistyped his name, who cares? Uh no, I think I think that's it right then. Oh, there's the crypt. Okay, um, let's re remove move those notes. Defended somehow. And so here, tomb of Alexius. Poison gas and brown. We're gonna need two crypt keys though. K one. K2, Bards is going to be K1, question mark, the Loyalists. I'm going to guess here is K2, but I don't know. Alright, we're on the upper floor, which we do not have a map for, so I guess consulting the map doesn't really help. Uh, but we're in, we're just up above this area, right? see a grate in the ceiling there. Okay, here's someone else coming by. There must be some kind of ventilation system to get clean air flowing around. We shall have to see if we can uh, use it for our own benefit. Okay, there's the guy that goes into that room. We'll see where he goes afterwards. I do have water arrows, but I need to use them where there's particularly useful, and I don't think this is a particularly useful spot. There's definitely a bunch of guys patrolling around here. There's a pretty short route around there, that guy. And the other guy, I don't... And the word went before him. I don't know how long before he comes through, so let's make a move. Doesn't look like I can, I can reach that. Oh, he had... Heard something. I don't think he actually saw me. Because he was just saying seaside trickery and show thyself, so I think he doesn't know I'm here. But he did hear my jump, which annoys me. Okay, he's given up. That's reasonably good news. So I have a moment to go out and. Okay, well, there's a ladder up there, but I don't see any ways for me to get up there, right? So, you know what? Let's close that again. Oh, 
Shit, is he coming here? Shit, he is. Right. Damn, where am I now? Got myself all turned around. Where did that priest go? Okay, the priest doesn't come all the way here. Alright, this feels like a relatively safe place to stop and put a quick save, because uh, at least we've got some shadow. And people aren't going to be walking past me here, bumping into me. Holy water. Let's not have the holy water al alarm light on, shall we? Apparently there isn't any holy water, it's busted. Okay, so he just comes here and stops and looks Hello? out. Who art thou? Wow, he actually noticed me as well. Again, damn light gem that I can't properly read, yeah. Okay. Something up with the holy water fountain that I should be doing something with. There's a pipe, I can't really climb it to get anywhere. There's this wood. We should see what's through that door as well, to be quite honest. Like, probably while I'm here. I think this is the moment to do so. Ah, I see. That is... Different little chapel. No, that's the one I came in before, but there's... Uh... Some valuables there that I did not deal with. Well, let's make a note then. Uh, loot. Loot on altar. We're gonna have to go out back out that way. So when we can go back, when we go back out and deal with the damn trying to get to Price's rooms again. Which I'm sure I'm going to have to, I'm sure it's not just the note that I found there about keys that's important, I'm sure that's where the blackmail would go is. <laughs> Hidden away in a secret, secret chamber somewhere or something. And we've got our friend coming back there. We could almost scout the main, main altar here. I, Again, wait till we're up above, I think. He will see us if I make a move now as well, I believe. Ugh, timing is bad. Timing is bad. The priest is going to be coming back. We'll wait for the priest to come and go again. 
Yeah, he's already he's already here. This guy will be on his way back out that way. Boost will be have his back turned. This guy should be out of our hair. Alright, this does feel like the uh, the right window of opportunity. Question is, can I uh, climb on this fence without making a big loud clanking noise? Only a small clanking noise. Okay, save. What do we have here? Holy water fountain, main valve control. Why is that relevant? Well, we've enabled the holy water. That's 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 good news. Okay, I don't know why we care about it, but holy water's up here. Holy water, second floor. There's that other vent as well that we found. Alright, that's gonna give us more vent options. Let's see where this goes. <laughs> Is this just the ladder I saw earlier? No. Quiet carrot. Uh, great four unit highs in a place where you don't have enough room to properly maneuver. There we go. So you do the whole your head getting stuck on it thing because you have to be going in at the time when your head bob is making you move down. Right, that's the one I saw, right? Yeah. And there's nowhere to put a, nowhere to put a rope here, so I don't know. I mean, there's a way out of these vents, I suppose. Okay, we have a way onto this roof. That will get us into that tower, right? Which would be the bell tower? And our friend who comes out onto this balcony. Okay, we could have gone on this roof. From there as well, I guess. Climb on the statues onto this roof. I didn't see the vent, the grate here. Kind of want to wait for this guy to come. I kind of don't want to bother. I kind of don't care. Kind of not bother. That's a nice quiet roof material, at least. Let's try climbing on this. Ah, uh, okay, this is bad. Oh no, just, this is fine. There's this. Actually, that's a bad replacement. We're getting it back. Good replacement for seeing if there's anything up here, though. Well, it looks like no, nobody's stored any uh, valuables there for us. Does anybody come out here? I don't know. Probably, right? Ah, okay, that guy patrols. Does he go into the towers? Hmm, seems like maybe not, but also maybe. Feels like that's a question worth knowing the answer to, though. <laughs> Does he come into this tower? We'll hear him. We can escape to the roof if we need to.
You see what I'm seeing in the shadow there? I think it's just weird shadow on the statue. Can't see anything in the bowl the statue's holding. Right, there's a sign by the door that I didn't read, because of course he can't get up to the door safely to read things. Oh, great. Did he see me there? Or is he always searching now? Is he just... Maybe he just does that animation and he didn't actually notice me the last time when I thought he was angry? I don't know. Come on. Where's this guy? Taking forever. You can hear his footsteps now. Very faint way. Okay, he doesn't come. He doesn't come this far. Maybe I was actually footsteps of somebody on the street I was hearing then. <laughs> Didn't come this far, but how do you get past him without a KO? Let's go that far sometimes. Well, let's have to hope. That he's not about to come back, is that we have somewhere we can hide here? Hello? I hold there. Good. <clears throat> yeah, you're breaking things, man. You already did. On top of the fucking beds. Who are you? I don't know. Help! Help! Don't worry, the priest already knows I'm here. What a fucking uh Ugh. Dying on the rope. Because it doesn't mantle properly. Cool, cool, cool. So we can make it here, but then we don't know if this guy is looking straight out the door at us in the bright fucking sunlight again. That's cool. Can't even see his face because he's looking straight at a fucking uh, thing in me, book stand. <clears throat> Does he turn? I don't know. Am I just wasting my time here? I don't know. Do I have anything I can throw? No. I suppose I can fucking flash bomb him. Yeah, well. Oh, cool. Help me! Alright, well, the answer is that's not the way we're going. That's not the way we're going to be getting to uh, the High Priest's office, I guess. And I'm guessing that's the High Priest's office, right? Can't tell if this is going to block AI vision or not. If it does, I'm fine sitting up there. If it doesn't, then he'll see me on his way back. Is that the pump? Well, I can see some loot there. <laughs> okay, so there's loot on a balcony... on... which 
side. The west. Loot on guard. Ugh. Okay. Loot on guarded balcony. D balc. Also balcony up there, probably got something to grab on it. Whatever. It's not the way it's not the way to go. It's not the way to go. I don't know how we're supposed to get into that room with the priest, but uh, since he's sitting watching both doors and there's no shadow at Oh either fucking one of them. It's a fucking tiny ledge that's... A ledge you're supposed to mantle that is not two fucking units wide because why should you be able to mantle safely onto a tiny little ledge, you know? Why are you expecting to be able to move around this level like you're playing Thief? No, you're supposed to be just like... Always inching around on everything because why not? Who cares about playability when you've got aesthetics, right? One more. I'm worried that he might see me, but I guess he won't now. We have this passage to go through as well. It's going east? Yes. Ah, okay. Here we can see the main altar. Oh. And we can see more guards that will still be watching the main altar and stuff. So that's the thing we need to get. It looks like I might have a boss field around it as well. On the plus side, there is some shadow right up there, but... Not a complaint specific to this mission, but things I don't like in terms of design is oh, so convenient air shafts up over the top of uh, high beams. I mean, it's kind of fun, but it's also no one puts ventilation shafts in rooms that don't need ventilation that are that are really high, right? Danger, toxic gas line, no torches, flares in this area. Huh. Northeast. Uh, a top beams toxic gas line. Need flame? Question mark. So notice it's green, right? We can't get in there. To turn it off. Maybe we can blow it up. Oh, we've got another ladder here. Let's see where the rest of this goes before I check up there. Because I'm cur curious about... Alright, this goes back to this one. So this is north of the main altar, or is this above the main altar? Oh, that's convenient. Oh, it's like they wanted to be stolen. Is that a force field? Kind of looks like a force field. Guess it's nothing to do but find out, right? Oh, the rope is not fucking long enough. The rope is not long enough. I'm not ready to go down there yet. I can moss it. <laughs> 
So I must sit and drop down and probably do so into the quieter corner. But I'm not ready to drop down there yet. Okay, so this is also alter access. Uh, let's move this node, right? Let's put here Wall Strand in the bars. And we'll put Martini in here. And say K1 double question mark. So it's probably with Wall Strand. Okay. Because what I want to do is uh, access from beams. E moss. If there's anything else that's guarding that scepter, we're going to need to be dealing with that too. Okay. Let's see where this ladder takes us. Roof access? Well, inaccessible roof access. Okay, no, nothing that opens it here. Alright. Let's assume that's there just for looking at and not actually a way that we're going to be able to get out. Don't have any fire arrows, so can't do anything with that yet. And when you've got huge open rooms like that, they don't need ventilation ducts. Like the, the air circulates fine. i got way more ducts here. Nice soft ones too, okay. okay it's this east again. Oh, there's a silver key. Okay, there's uh, silver gear in duct. I can't read that. It's got to be accessed from below, though. This one doesn't open. Don't know why we need a silver gear. Ah, okay. Now I know where we are. I can't put that in from here. Well, that's all right. We'll, we'll live with that. There will be no further beating of the dummies after test prayers. The shouting and thudding sound have become quite distracting as my quarters are right next to the courtyard. Cardinal Martinian. Novus Severian, after you assisted me with servicing the collector tower on the roof, my best diamond drill bit is missing. I expect you to get up in the vents and fetch it back for me before you sleep. Novus Tocenti, I entrusted you with five silver gears. Two were used to repairs and two were turned back in. You have until tomorrow morning to turn in the last one or all novices will be in the vents searching. Gentlemen, this sort of carelessness is unacceptable. If I need to put a flogging post in the courtyard to concentrate your thoughts, I shall. Brother Erland. Okay, collector tower on the roof, drum, diamond drill bit. Uh, let's make a note up here. Roof. Diamond drill. So roof access. We can see... Uh, roof access from vents. How? We saw the silver gear. Novus Colgan, I must purify myself before the council meeting tonight. Make sure my finest outfit is made ready and bring it to the bathhouse before Tertian prayers. False friend. Okay, also Martinian's Martinian's chambers are here. Martinian's room is near the courtyard, right? If we need anything from his room, we know where it is. Well, I don't know exactly how I'm going to manage this guy, because we need to get out past him. 
and into the other room, right? We want to go into that other room and search it. But if this guy is going back and forth all the time, he kind of harshes the vibe. <gasps> Probably gonna notice that too and get suspicious. Off the right. I'm gonna be able to scout where he goes. Oh. And my coffee has run out. Fifteen minutes early. I thought he went into that other room sometimes. Where did he go? He turned the corner? Oh, he must, must have been there. What's going on? It's just a banner that's fallen apart. They do that spontaneously. You know the shoddy manufacturer of these things. Is there a walkway there? Did he walk somewhere? In either case, there is no way to, no way to hide out there. But we can certainly try following him out. Oh, it's the stairs. here in the doorway. If we could turn the lamp off we might have some darkness but wait till the novice is gone so we're just dealing with two things at once. If thou be there, bespeak thyself. I see thee there. Who art thou? I shall still find thee, never fear. Dang it. Where are we? This is... The stairs here? The stairs down to the courtyard? Oh yes. Okay. Stairs up. Very important stairs up. It's not this courtyard we're at, this, I don't think. No, because it's looking at the gate here. And it's got the training dummies. Do I miss here? Yay, candles so that I can light, unlight. Alright, where are we now? We're in a storage room under here. So I do want to check out this... You know what? While we're here, I want to finish checking out this room. Because then, then, then we're done in there, right? Oh, there's a, what? there's a ledge. There's a ledge around the outside. Okay, we can maybe get on that ledge. And get in through a window. I didn't see a window. We can try it. No harm in giving it a try. If not, I can see there was. We could probably rope up from just inside the doorway. What's that up there? Boy, there's strange noises there. <laughs> there is a window. Beams above. What's the reading? The arrogance of the Sprayos is beyond belief. First, he wants to inspect every inch of the Golden Cathedral as if it's already his. This upstart was never even ordained a cardinal. He only occupies that position because old Casota died, and I have some suspicions about how that happened as well. Now he wears purple as if he was emperor already and raises men in golden armor like the Exordium Guard from the old days. This is the last straw. 
I thought my highest duty was to stay above politics and tend to my cathedral, but now I see that he cannot be allowed any position of great power. I fear Proyas will not accept the Council's judgment when we vote against him tomorrow. Many of the brothers here have been seduced by his promises to restore the Hamarite Church to Imperial power. If it came to a contest of arms, Proyas might well be victorious. I will use my personal holy symbol to create a magical barrier in the crypts. No one is getting through that barrier unless they carry a holy symbol of their own, purified and blessed. This should keep him from getting to the crown of St. Alexius long enough for our men to arrive from Sunnyport and Elbridge. Do you have a key on you? No, do you have a key on your desk? Yeah. Seems not. You have. Hello? Who art thou? Not here. You are. All is well now. Twas but the wind on the torches. You have a fucking chest up there. I can't take this anymore. This is absolutely ridiculous. Every time I turn around, there's incompetence. How come incompetence in every act that I see? Oh, this is a this light gradient. It doesn't feel like it's dark enough here. I mean, I'm not complaining that I have enough darkness to get to this stuff. I will have to be a little bit more strict with my orders so that they're clear and people can carry them out with some kind of certitude. Alright, I want one rope up there. I want one up here. so many now build without consideration for the master builder his mark is no longer upon the life of the city and the taint of the tricks we will always seek it. <laughs> is someone there Who hey ah uh, he's lighting the place up again the christmas tree that's a pretty damn bright light he's using the place cannot last it seems quiet enough now. Tis well. Ugh. I can't He's not even going back to work. Ridiculous. Every time I turn around, there's incompetence, incompetence. In to his book stand. He's standing next to it. By myself. Well, I can't do it all. By Gotta wait till this light goes off, though. So he's making way too much light in the room. It's way too light by the chest where I need to be. Tried to do a soft jump, but it wasn't soft enough. Should have tried to just run across the mantle, but that's less reliable. So I didn't want him to do that, but yeah, I didn't expect him to react that much to the jump. Well, I also expected to land silently, but it misjudged. Okay, his light's off. I guess maybe his light wasn't actually a threat for this position, I don't know. Do we have to pick it? Something moved, thought I stood. Intruder! Beware an intruder! <clears throat> There's no intruder here. <gasps> well, isn't it lucky you have all this food handy? Not to mention a healing potion. So how am I going to get down to that without him fucking seeing me again? Well, one answer is I try the uh, jump and then I try the mantle and both of those fail and uh, I reload. Okay. Well, if I try a different rope... Maybe won't need to... Uh... Be so noisy? <coughs> Question mark? I'll grab that one later. Stand on top of it while picking, while picking the lock. That's right. Because that? if I move there, it's too bright. But I guess I could have picked it from the rope, maybe? I don't know. I see that part from here? No. Well, that's not for a very solid standing position. 
Yeah, come on. All right, if I just wiggle out along here and not get stuck. There we go. There we go. All right. Where is he now? He's there, okay. Unfortunately, it's a long way to fall, isn't it? Am I just gonna leave a rope here? I might just leave the rope here. How many do I have? Still got four. Yeah, I can't, I can't grab that without. Well, maybe if I put one in the bottom of this beam, I can grab that one and drop it from here. Because if it's in the bottom of the beam instead of the top, it's a little more uh, accessible, right? A slightly greater distance. <coughs> That'll do. <laughs> Don't think there's anything else I need from here. Right, we need a holy symbol. Uh, need. That's why we need the holy water. So we're going to need a holy symbol. Need holy. Holy. Can I spell? No. We're gonna need two keys and a holy symbol. How do we make a holy symbol? I guess we found the holy water supply. We know how to turn that on now. Ah! Sigh. Making tiny narrow ledges. Yeah, I don't have to drop onto from just above. Cool, cool, cool. Not like it's a thing that. You know. Oh, right, I didn't even notice this left. We could have come around here from the other side. That would have been better. Cool. That's all right. Opportunity is missed, but that's not... Not problematic. All right. Is our friend here? Yes. What's that up there? Nothing. <laughs> If you want to drop quietly on something, you have to be standing up properly. That means when it's really thin, you have to you mantle it. Then you have to like back up just a tiny fraction, not a whole step, but just a, just enough to just get on it. And it's like, yeah, we played Thief enough to know that this is the mechanics, but it's also always awkward to do. Well, you tiny drop distance on that. Second, I'm here. Just wondering if someone else was coming in here. Well, I do appreciate the uh, candles that I can put out on well, the pluses from this mission compared to the uh, previous mission that I played, which was um, I can't remember the name now. Okay, oh, what is what have we got up there? That's glowing. Hmm, an indicator of something behind a door. Well, that looks like we're gonna have to go there, but not just yet. More rope, I that's handy. Ooh, forbidden, huh? This is that's the priest's rooms, right? There is a does anybody come out? along this walkway. I haven't heard footsteps the whole time I was in here. Very, it's a little odd to be not quite honest that the priests get a big fancy covered walkway leading into a dingy storage room. I mean, I thought the priests would have complained about using this as a storage room on their way to the thing, but whatever. I was not to reason why, I was just to steal and die. I'm very good at the dying bit. He's gonna come out here and see me and immediately execute me. No, he's going into that room, okay. Which has a label next to it. I kinda of want him to come back and uh See if I can read the label. 
know what? Let's just do that next episode. So, uh, see you then.